Let's talk cannabis. Now I've got your attention. Eastern Cape Premier Oscar Maboyane says he wants to grow the economy of the province, if you'll excuse the turn of phrase, and a good part of it is going to come from cannabis. Maboyane delivered the State of the Province address on Thursday. He's echoed the words of President Ramaphosa, saying the government is going to rework the regulatory framework around the production of both cannabis and hemp. But what does it actually mean for informal traders who've been doing this already and living on the proceeds from, of marijuana for years? Well, ENCA is in Heber in Tlanganisa, visited the Pondo land and filed this report. This is Simbonile Lukoko. His business name is Papanaiza. He's been cultivating cannabis for 23 years now. After leaving school in grade 7 due to financial challenges. The Papanaiza says he was fortunate enough to be mentored by a group of specialists from overseas. Now he's using that knowledge and impacting it to the fellow villagers. And the number of people coming to Papanaiza for coaching has grown over the years. The specialist highlighted the health benefits of marijuana. Eastern Cape's Premier Oscar Mabuyane, during his State of the Province address, announced the appointment of an advisory panel to guide the development of the province's cannabis economy. Cannabis is emerging as a potential sector for growth in the country. The streamlining of the regulatory process towards enabling the cannabis and hemp sector will accelerate our efforts to build the cannabis industry. One analyst says these 130,000 jobs that the president and the premier were talking about must be directed to Pondoland, as that part of the province has a high rate of poverty. People of Pondoland, where this is grown, the farmers, indigenous farmers who are uneducated there, should be given free licenses to farm cannabis so that they are able to produce it as they were producing before. It was good quality. And then their children are trained on how to process cannabis. Give thanks, man, for the honor and the privilege of this day and the subsequent day. You are asking for them and those. Papa Niza and his partner take a relaxing puff. Neighbor Tanganiso, Port St. John's, Eastern Cape.